<laughs> one or the other. It's definitely, I mean, Bismarck, I mean, we can't not add the Bismarck. The Bismarck just won't be tier 10 because it'll get pummeled by tier 10s. The, the Montana and the... Yeah, the Mont yeah, yeah, and the yeah, like, yeah. Um, So it's more likely going to be coming in at around about tier 8, I think, or something like that. Now, Bismarck, Bismarck and Tempest, they are more like <laughs> the most famous ship. Mm -hmm. What about Hood? Hood's going to be in game as well. What tier? Yeah. Um, probably around about the same tier because it was similar um, to um, the Bismarck. Um, it's not going to have a weak ammo rack as much as everyone jokes about. Because always saying like, yeah, it's going to have a weak ammo rack. It was like, and the Bismarck is going to get a single torpedo and it's going to get a rudder damage and it's never going to get out of it. <laughs> Um, but there's, there's, the ships are have things in them that are not that they had historically, but they're not in there for game balance. So the the British battleships won't be able to launch torpedoes despite them having torpedo launchers. I mean the 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 Rodney was the only ship that actually had battleship to battleship torpedoes launched at Bismarck. Um, so the the Rodney's not going to have its torpedoes. The the Warspite doesn't have its torpedoes. If you gave the battleships torpedoes, they'd just be too insanely jack of all trades. Yeah. Agreeable. And they weren't necessarily that effective either. Warspite. Warspike's a fantastic ship. 70 second turn time by 180 degrees, that's a lot. But the thing is, is the that on the Russian it. servers it's, it's received very negatively, so the players in Russia are trying to push for it to get a, um, a buff. And in Europe we're like, we don't really think it needs a buff, but we're going to stay quiet. And if they're going to buff it, they're going to buff the turret traverse, and we're going to sit quiet on it, because it's one of my <laughs> favourite ships. Because like, yeah. <laughs> they, they won't add the fighter, they won't give it the fighter, it'll stay with the sport plane, they won't put the fighter on it. Because if it had the fighter, it would be ridiculous to be able to, to get rid of torpedoes, because that's its main threat. So the battleships that do have the single fighter, this one fighter is the equivalent of like a five-man squadron, and it's like really powerful. But the worst fight won't get one sadly. <laughs> It'll stick with the smaller planes. But still, the HMS Wing is a majesty, a victory. Put that in. Nelson should put in and let kill Nelson again. Yeah, they've got, they've got, um, <laughs> and again. Yeah. And again. <laughs> No, that's, that's another thing, and I mean, somebody was just joking, we had a presentation recently from a marketing director and he brought up, uh, what was it, Waterloo? Yeah? Yeah, he, he brought up that up and was winding up all the French people in the office and was saying, oh yeah, look, you had the superior numbers and we still beat you, and all this, like, all, all the office rivalry is really funny with the different language teams. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you know, guys, I'm, I'm German team, I'm sitting between... Arnaud from French, French team, team and uh, Piotr Polish from team. Polish team. And before that, you, before that, you were sitting between the Polish team and the, the English team, yeah. yeah. But I mean, I, I got it. I mean, I got it the worst when uh, when Scotland didn't get independence. So it was like. <laughs> 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 and, and the thing, the thing, because you didn't have The thing that made it worse, is, made it worse <laughs> is every day I would come in, every, I would always wind up our um, our lead producer, um, <laughs> Russian guy. Um, Oh, go throw your stones, Scotsman, go throw your stones! Oh, that's not <laughs> and, um, I was like, where's the Scotland flags? Where's the Scotland flags? Show me on globe where country Scotland is! <laughs> he has the globe on his desk and it's just got United Kingdom. It's not split into Scotland anymore. Like, oh, see, no, no Scotland, no Scotland. <laughs> how large is Russia now compared to before? That's what I keep saying. says, we're going, to, we're going to leave England and join Russia before you invade us. And then, was, and then, and then when I said to him about the Scotland flags, he says, if we get independence tomorrow, you're going to give me the Scotland flag because we're a separate country. He's like, we'll see tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> what happens? I stay up all night, you know, big important thing. It doesn't happen. Scotland doesn't get independence. Walking to work the next day, hang my head and that. Like, <laughs> not even going to look at him. And all I hear is like the sound of headsets getting taken off. And then, oh! <laughs> 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 oh! I remember it so much. <laughs> just, just this loud, this loud laughter. And then every time I walked over to ask him or talk to him about anything, he just looked at me. You didn't consider sending him a little letter bomb. No, <laughs> but um, he's he's a good guy. But every every time I always wind him up, he's asking, you know, what do you want to see? What's the what's the most requested player feature for World of Tanks? <laughs> Scotland flags. <laughs> 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 it doesn't work. <laughs> but, um, he's a good laugh. But next next time maybe you are laughing. Well, you asking why the Russian friends so German? I mean, they're going to be called Europe. Oh, but just, so. the, the thing is, is just, that, that's the thing that's hardest for us. Is like, I mean, there's lots of stuff that people say in game that's really, really bad, and we have to take action against. But if, and, and some things we seem like really like um, straight laced, like no sense of humor or war game, and don't care. But if anybody was actually to, if we had a hidden camera in our office, they would be up. 
appalled by the stuff, especially the way we talk to each other. It's all, it's all friendly stuff and it's all like just non-stop yeah, banter all the time. Action. It's like, oh, the printer's not working. Is it ran out of paper or is the Polish team stole the paper again? Or something. <laughs> <laughs> stuff like, and every time like something's like not working or it's not done well, it's like, oh, the German team's going to come in and they're going to make it efficient. It's always German efficiency and all this kind of stuff. <laughs> yeah, it's like, oh, the French team, what are they like? Oh, what are you going to do? Go on strike, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I'll put, I'll put cheese on everything. Yeah, it's like, and, uh, where's, where's, where's the Spanish team? Oh, they're sleeping. You're like, go find them. Oh, it's siesta time. All this kind of stuff. Yeah. And it's like non non stop like jokes like that. We laugh about the English team about the bad taste of food. Yeah, this is this is right. He's the English community manager. Don't worry, everyone knows he doesn't speak English. You know that as well. We have, we have, um, the yeah, the English team was made up of four people previously, not only one of them was English. So we had, we had a, a New Zealander, a Scotsman, um, a Serbian and one Englishman. And the two community coordinators, who was um, Irina, who was Erissa, and Grimbrew, who was Mike, um, they've both left recently for other jobs. So that's why if anyone visits the tanks forums recently, the, the interaction's been kind of slow and not theirs, because we're two people down in the team right now. And it's normally community coordinators are the ones who would do the, the most posting on the forums. So we're about to hire two new people to replace well, that. I can start on Monday. <laughs> <laughs> you, have to, you, have to, you, have to, you have to move to France for that to pass. No problem. They were no. All no. Uh, yeah, that's the other one. One was British. So there's only one and a half left. One, uh, yeah. Well, every time we talk about it, Ryan's not, Ryan's not British, he's Scottish, he was always there. <laughs> Actually, they have it with me. I think I have it with me. Uh -huh. The name badge is Have you heard about the Haggis gun? Haggis <laughs> gun? Yeah. Porridge gun. You shoot the Haggis with, with a porridge gun. It's a, it's a bird like thing that runs around mountains, but only one way because the one leg is so longer. One leg, one leg shorter than another, so you can catch it by uh, spinning it the other way around yeah. and shooting with a porridge gun. So, um, when we go to Gamescom, everyone gets name badges made up um, to show everyone what your language speaks at. Do you have maybe your one or do you no, have one? I have mine, yeah. Okay, so we'll show it, we'll get, we'll show it. Um, I know this one is an example first. <laughs> and then you will we'll see mine. And this is something I used to fight for every year. And they didn't do it one year and it caused chaos. And then this, last year when I was at Gamescom, they argued it. So there's, there's Arno's flag, okay, Arno's name badge. So it shows everyone, if anyone looks at Arno, he speaks um, French, and the British wants to show that he speaks English, okay? So everyone, everyone, <laughs> everyone, everyone, everyone who was multi-language, they would have their national language and they would have that as English speaker. So it helped with the German people to say like, we don't speak German, and the German people would have a, a German flag there as well. So for me... <laughs> <laughs> After many years of fighting, they put the salt tire on it. That, that looks like the flag the Russians are yeah. sailing under. So um, that's a running joke saying, oh, you speak Scottish. I'm like, well, can you understand something? And usually I'd be like, Ryan, Ryan, come here. This guy's Scottish, can you speak to him? <laughs> so that was, that was on year one, and then they removed it in year two. Because year one it was like done as an in-joke, haha, look, we've got a Scotland flag. I'm like, yes, Scotland flag! I'm so happy, and they're like, damn, that kind of backfired. And 